Hey, what's going on? I'm A-Dub from DX Daily Podcast, and you gotta check this out. As fans have seen with his sprawling Georgia mansion, insane car collection, and real-life animals roaming the property, Rick Ross has a lot of money. When it comes to wealth, Rose will be one of the first to speak his mind on the topic, such as he did when NFTs were booming a few months ago. The Maybach Music Group boss was quick to criticize people investing in NFTs back in May as he asked, what the metaverse about? See, that's the thing about Rick Ross. That's the thing about the boss. The metaverse, crypto, y'all getting so much money, where you at? Where you at? Show us. And I don't mean, oh, I'm trying to put money. Man, I got a lot of money. I ain't even need that fake money. But show us, show my homies what the metaverse about. One of y'all big boy crypto dudes, guru crypto, pitch and take us, step up and say, this is what we going to do, Rose. Where you at? Huh? Yeah, everybody giggling, looking around. <laughs> All that fake rich money, where it's at? And shortly after that, the crypto market plummeted. Rick Ross wasted no time ridiculing the crash, and it looks like he's not done dragging people still investing. The Miami native took to his Twitter early Thursday morning, July 7th, to ask what people are doing with all the bored ape NFTs that dominated the market earlier this year. According to Ross's tweet, it seems like he still does not see the point behind the craze. What you guys do with your bored ape monkey NFTs? He took things a step further in his Instagram story during his usual motivational speeches as he flexed the real cash he's earned over the years with a simple gesture. According to Ross, someone asked who's the richest rapper in the game today and he laughed it off with confidence. Somebody just say, Rose, who you think got the most money out the rap game? And I said, <laughs> I don't know, cause it's a lot of assumptions. <laughs> Money to hold me like. Ross has gone so hard against the metaverse that he thought he was responsible for the crash in May. He got on Instagram to ask if he were responsible for comments he made days prior about investors showing the money they're allegedly making in the metaverse. And I just woke up and I heard the NFT market crash 92%. I hope that wasn't because of my post, was it? Somebody from NFT called me and told me this shit. Tell me this shit crashed on its own and Rose ain't responsible. But what do you think about the status of NFTs right now? Do you think Rick Ross was right? Let us know your thoughts in the comments section below. Make sure to hit that subscribe button and notification bell to stay up to date on all of our new videos and subscribe to the DX Daily Podcast on all streaming platforms. And as always, make sure to keep it all the way locked to popdx.com.